man gets, he's always going to have options. Younger, finer, fitter, willing. But they wasted all their time telling all these good men, oh, no, you know, you're not my type. And, you know, I need a man that's going to do all this stuff for me. You, you too broke for me. Y'all brag about the fact that y'all don't cook. You brag about the fact that you're not cleaning for nobody. You brag about the fact that you're selfish. You brag about all these things that are contrary to what a man wants. What happens is they start approaching that wall. Once they are approaching that wall, or once they hit it, they already got kids, they're not in their prime anymore, and then they get frustrated. They try to convert other women and try to convince other women that they also don't need men because now they no longer qualify. Now what are you left with? You're broken, used, washed up, your self-worth, your dignity, all of that done gone. Now what you gonna do? You love talking about yourself and you could do bad all by yourself and you it's all about me and because I'm the prize, where are your results then? If you're the prize, who the prize winner? If you're the prize, where is the collector of the prize? <laughs> I'm glad she said it. Because God forbid, if a man would say all that, he would catch a lot of hate and a lot of fire from the women. Heck, they would try to have him canceled. But the reality is, this poor woman, she's going to be probably going to come after her. they call me a picnic. No. I can bet you any amount of money that young queen has her king. And what she says has been the same thing we've been saying for years. But you know what? I said before, I said it again. i glad she said it. Because if a man would have said it, he would cut all sorts of grief. So all I'm going to say to that young lady, rock on. <laughs>